和硕端进公主 ，the princess Duan Jing of the second rank, was Kangxi's fifth biological daughter. She was born in 1674 by noble lady Bu. Although she was Kangxi's second surviving daughter, her birth didn't give Kangxi any happiness. First, Duan Jing's biological mother. Zhao Jiashi wasn't Kangxi's favorite woman. In Qing Dynasty, once a woman gave birth a child for the emperor, the lowest rank she could get was Guiren, noble lady. When Zhao Jiashi was pregnant, she was a first-class female attendant. In 1707, she was promoted. To noble lady, and kept in this rank until she passed away. Second, Duan Jing was born in a very wrong time. In the beginning of 1673, the rebellion of Wu Shangui happened, and Kangxi didn't have confidence that the central government could win. Even worse. Three days before Duan Jing was born, Kangxi's beloved wife, the Empress Xiao Changren, passed away after she gave birth a boy. Kangxi deeply loved his wife, so Xiao Changren's death made Kangxi extremely sad. Under this situation, no one dared to celebrate Duan Jing's birth. In 1692, Kangxi promoted Duan Jing to He Shuo Duan Jing Gongzhu, the Princess Duan Jing of the second rank, and arranged her to get married with a no- Mongolian noble, Ga Er Zheng. Although Duan Jing and Ga Er Zheng had two boys, but we don't think they had great relationship. In 1710, Duan Jing passed away. When the funeral process didn't finish yet, Ga Er Zheng forced a married woman to become his mistress, and killed her husband. In 1711, Ga Er Zheng lost his second-rank prince title, and was arrested. Eventually. He died in jail. In 1717, the noble lady Bu passed away. Considering she was Duan Jing's biological mother, Kangxi allowed her funeral to be held using the imperial concubine standards. In 1719, Duan Jing's tomb was finished, and she was buried. One month later, the noble lady Bu was buried in Kangxi's consort's tombs. In 1922, after stayed in the jail for eleven years, Ga Er Zheng passed away. Duan Jing and Ga Er Zheng's son begged Kangxi to allow his parents to be buried together. Kangxi agreed. Thank you for watching this 